Andre Tuktan now I stand at my pang. Good morning everyone. My name is Mane. I belong to Indigenous Penong. I am currently the Executive Director of Cambodian Indigenous People Organization. Today uh, I'm very pleased to share about the contribution on the International Indigenous People World Day related to the biodiversity. Um, when we're talking about the biodiversity, it's very important for our Indigenous people. I mean, throughout the world. Why? Because uh, we living depend on those biodiversity. The biodiversity is connected to our culture, to our social and economy. So the biodiversity is very important for our life to live more sustainable way. And in the context of Cambodia, um, the Cambodian government have been ratified the Biodiversity Con uh, Convention in 1995. And also the Cambodian government have been adopted the national law, include constitution law and the land law, forestry law and protected area law. That have been, in the previous one, it have been respected and recognized the indigenous people right to land and natural resources based on our traditional uh, practice, as well as the government also have been ratified the UN declaration on indigenous people which we have been very much appreciated. However, the currently uh, we face some challenge because of our government have been amendment uh, and also uh, produced the new law include the environmental code as well as the other law in forestry law and uh, protected law where it have been restricted and limited our rights in access to those uh, resources. So come to the result of this amendment and adopt the new law. It it have been affected uh, to our traditional practice and also affected to our use. Can the benefit from those uh, resources when we are trying to practice our traditional occupation or farming, especially when we are practice our farming, because the government have been prioritized on protecting area where it's overlapping with indigenous community target. So come to the practical, we become the criminal lie over our land and natural resources. So with this regard, I would like to suggest and call to the government, look at the previous law and then trying to revise and adjust the law, the current new law or amendment in order to consistent with the international legal standard, including the CBD, including the UN Declaration on Indigenous People, including the previous national law, including the land law that have been well known as one of the best policy framework recognized Indigenous people right. So this is very important in order to ensure that Indigenous people right to use the biodiversity as well as to maintain the protection of the biodiversity remaining strongly lead managed by indigenous in a sustainable way for the benefit for everyone. Thank you.